I keep reading and hearing all these talks about Callisto Protocol, The Last of Us, and Resident Evil remakes, but this upcoming horror title, Ill, which came alongside a new trailer at the Future Game Show this year, or early this year, has been stuck in my head all this time. Ill shows off some startlingly realistic monsters in creepy dark hallways. Anyone with a taste for gruesome gore and suspense will truly enjoy this compilation of trailers and gameplays. The game is actively developed by Team Cloud with no precise release date in mind. The developer has made enough progress to show off a few trailers here and there though, but you know, there are some clearly talented animators and artists working on this game. We can totally see writhing tentacles on malformed bodies of monsters that were perhaps once human. This compilation of trailers show traditional zombies in the games as well. It appears that Ill is about fighting these abominations but there will also be an emphasis on a narrative perhaps about what created the infestations. For sure there will be a few share of jump scares in the game if you're into that. It looks impressively done where a corpse is suddenly attached to something straight out of nightmares. Naturally you have to follow these creatures along as they shuffle away to inevitably ambush you elsewhere. What stands out about this footage for Ill is the realism and impressive visuals. The developer confirmed the game utilizes Unreal Engine 5 and there's no shortage of graphically impressive projects that use this engine. Team Cloud appears to be a small studio with little information listed aside from their social media channels via Linktree and their main website. As of today in early September 2022, I've looked through their Patreon page and what seems to be the only subscription to make sense is the $3 early access. Everything else, it's got a tag that says, at this moment, we do not offer anything extra for higher tiers. We are thankful for any participation. There's no sign of actively campaigning the game for funds in Kickstarter as well. So this begs the question, is the game being actively developed? Who knows? I'm just checking in for Shonex Gaming. And you know, I'm looking to keep my channel active with a different approach. So expect a few reviews like this to pop up anytime soon. So thank you for tuning in and do please subscribe if you enjoyed this video. I'll see you again next time.